so here i am back with an example for testing the dimension of a solution space of the given uh, linear system let's say we are having a system that is represented as 1 0 2 2 1 3 and then 3 1 2 okay and it unknown variables are x1 x2 and x3 and basically it's a homogeneous system okay and the problem is you have to find the dimension of the solution space solution space of the above system okay of solution space uh, solution space of a let's say we will uh, call it a matrix uh, i will apply just the gauss elimination method for finding out the solution of this system so let's just start it or start forming it's the augmented matrix and then i will be applying the elementary row operations for converting this system into an upper triangular matrix so let's just start since the pivot entry is already equal to 1 we don't need to scale the pivot and i will perform the operations or change in r2 and it will be like r2 minus 2 times of r1 and similarly i will perform the operation on r3 and that is operation is r3 minus 3 times of r1 fine the first row remains as it is it doesn't cause any change on it this entry will be equal to 0 then it will be equal to 1 and 3 minus 4 is equal to minus 1 again 0 similarly this entry will be 0 it will be 1 and 2 minus 6 is equal to minus 4 okay now this is my pivot entry in the second row and I have to make this entry below the pivot entry equal to 0 all I need to perform the operation is on R3 and this is actually R3 minus R2 simply okay so you will have 1 0 2 here 0 0 1 minus 1 then 0 and then 1 minus 1 0 minus 4 plus 1 minus 3 and hey you will get this entry equal to 0 okay now let's just try to solve this system since we can clearly see here uh, we are having minus 3x3 is equal to 0 so this will employ x3 is equal to 0 okay the next is uh, the next equation that we will get x2 minus x3 is equal to 0 so this will give me again x2 is equal to x3 which is also equal to 0 fine and from the back substitution i will have x1 plus 2x3 is equal to 0 this will again result in x1 is equal to minus 2 times of x3 and x1 is equal to 0 since x3 is equal to 0 obviously no matter what you are multiplying with the constant 0 you will res uh, the resultant will be equal to 0 so the solution space actually consists of only one vector that is x having the components x1 x2 and x3 and these values are equal to 0 0 and 0 actually this system has only the trivial solution and no other solution exists that's why only one vector which is actually the zero vector is lying in the solution space of this vector space that's why we will say that the dimension is equal to 1 dimension of solution space is equal to 1 why because only one vector is present 
in the solution space of this matrix thank you for watching